Will I die in this chapter, chat? Place your bets. What do you think? I don't hear any, any bullshit about my bread. Place your bet. Oh, God. Have there any cool boss fights yet? Not really. And the fights that are in the game, I would say, are kind of a downgrade from the original, in my opinion. Like, they, they actually got more simplistic and less engaging. So, the bosses, I think, are a bit of a downgrade so far. The Regenerator fight was mostly exactly the same. Uh, the Asteroid boss, I guess I'll call it a boss, because why not? The Asteroid cannon thing was very simple, very easy. It was over in two seconds. And the, uh, the Leviathan boss was very easy as well, so... I died twice hard because yeah when you die in impossible you either start over or keep going on hard mode so you know i i thought i would you know let me ruin the rest of my stream and, and <laughs> i decided to not do that uh i would like more damage on my contact beam Yeah, bosses were never Dead Space's best part, but however, I still feel like they kind of made them... I still feel like they kind of made them worse in this game so far. Now, that's not like a huge issue overall, but... It wasn't like I love the original b d bosses, but it's just kind of a weird change, you know? Okay, I don't have much to sell or do here yet. OOT Rando later. Nope. Well, right not. Subjects are locked down, even though all systems are running. I'm going to figure this out. Do I think it'd be easy for first time players too in this game? Yeah, probably. Nope. No Rando. Krungos, you said you were going to leave when I wasn't playing Mario, and that was like six hours ago. Why don't you stick a cork in it and shut the fuck up, motherfucker? You're clearly not going anywhere. Man, I feel like the line gun is fucking wimpy in this game. I feel like they nerfed the shit out of it. This is not Mar- Yeah, the line gun seems pretty fucking wimpy to me so far, unfortunately. The line gun was so OP in the original. It was good. It was, I don't know if I'd say it was OP. It was good. So those are not happy friendship beams I'm gathering. Uh, interesting. Uh, interesting. Okay, so you kind of have to like kind of have to block these okay weird weird 
I was on your TV since you left for work. Uh, Matt Cooper, somebody posted once a long time ago. I don't remember who it was, but they posted on Discord that they had watched my stream so much that they had burn in on their monitor of like my outline sitting in the bottom left of their monitor. <laughs> <laughs> you see that happening on a TV. Okay, game says that way, so what's over here? Look at people see the Virgin Mary in bread. <laughs> you know, you know, maybe I should offer a barbed toaster where when you toast it, it makes my face on your piece of bread after you toast the bread. Now that's a genius idea. There's your million dollar idea right there. Yes! Very genius. Okay, I still don't know what the purpose of these things is. Are these like a collectible? Security request retrieved. Or maybe you need... Security. We got some freak called Harris stealing from ore storage. Dr. Mercer sent me for Osmium to complete his work. Yeah, I don't care if God Almighty sent you. You skim from CEC's profit margin, we get screwed. God. So you can put that osmium down, or I can break your arms first. I worked with people like you on Aegis 7. They'd steal my power nodes. Leave me to dig with no light. Hey, hey! Get off me! But when they abandon you in the dark, it's not empty. The marker whispered its revelations there. Now I understand them. There's a place that makes custom toasters. <laughs> you want to hear? Warning. Unchanged personnel may not use the suit kiosk. No, no, stop, please. I said please when they shut me in. Screamed it too. I promise I won't laugh <laughs> like they did. Warning. My idea is very <laughs> realistic. <laughs> Incident report filed to bridge by Dr. Nicole Brennan. See related rig activity. Okay, some kind of objective. I wonder if all these things eventually are how you get the maximum security. Like that's how you can get the maximum security clearance or something. So that that's probably it then. You got to complete all these side quests, then you can do that. Excuse me. God, could you just die? Thank you. Stop me ever again. <laughs> People stomp. Oh, that was fucking weird. Why would it look like that? <laughs> Okay. No stop. This man's been streaming for ten and a half hours. Ten and a half hours, man. That's right. No, once you, so again, I started off on impossible difficulty. Once you die, it kicks you back down to hard mode or you can quit the game. So I want to see the rest of the game. I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to make my first time ever beating the game, you know, impossible mode. So. Hello, Bumby. No signs of stopping. 
Yeah, I played uh, I played Hades for the first three hours. It's because we're waiting for it to release. Secured the sub deck perimeter, IEDs, plasma cutters. Uh, okay. I feel like the text logs were more interesting in the first game or in the original game, rather. It's not like a huge deal, but just in general. It felt like they're a little bit bloated in this game. Nothing, nothing particularly revelatory or interesting. Am I playing on PC? I am playing on PlayStation 5. Yeah, this game came out at uh, 11 a.m. Eastern for me. Okay, now this room, typically this room is pretty Son nasty. Of a bitch. There's usually a fucking nasty ambush in here. Uh Dave Randolph, thank you for the 15 months. Really appreciate that. Thank you very much. Level 3 security clearance required. $1500 dollar dues. Launch tube sealed. Please contact Supervisor Dallas for authorization. Finally getting somewhere with the mining duct system. Got the SOS begin? Son of a bitch. I need a deck administrator's rig to get them open. The deck admin is Supervisor Dallas. Empathy Val, thank you for 34 months. Thank you very much. for a Jacob Temple 2 maintenance sub deck. Maybe he left the SOS beacon there. Just hope you can reach it through these malfunctions. Not malfunctions. Traps. <laughs> the miner's way of holding the line. Shit. Okay. I'll unlock the subdex. Just make sure that beacon's not wired to anything. I was waiting for the ambush. Give this people air. Ah, uh, Treehouse. Thank you for the 62 months. Thank you very much. What's new in the game? So, in the original Dead Space, the levels were kind of one level and then a loading screen, and then the next level and then a loading screen. This game, it kind of all flows from one level to another. So. Uh, that means that there's like new content kind of new material that kind of combines all the levels uh, I'd say that the level design in general has changed like there's many differences in every level and I'd say overall the level design changes are good um, Like many of the encounters are different the weapons have all been rebalanced so the weapons I feel like in dead space one you need like two weapons and you're good in this game I kind of feel like I need all the weapons so uh, all the weapons kind of have their own purpose in this game, I feel like. And I think that's a pretty positive change. From a negative side, I feel like the voice acting and story has gotten weaker and not quite as good. Uh, I think the voice actors... I think the guy who does Art Isaac is pretty good. I think Kendra's pretty good. The guy who does Hammond is... He seems, like, bored or something. Like, I don't know. His voice acting isn't very good. Um... The plot, I'm not sure even exactly what's supposed to be going on at this point in terms of the plot. I mean, I know the original plot of Dead Space, so I can fill in the blanks, but we're just kind of vaguely looking for Nicole, I guess, kind of. I like the original Dead Space because in the original Dead Space, it felt like you were in the beginning of in the first part of the game, you were just trying to keep the ship flying, like, because the, the ship was about to crash and you're trying to solve all the problems while dealing with the necromorphs, right? In this game, it's like, uh, I don't know, go here, I guess. Okay, sure. So I feel like something was lost there, in my opinion. Going up. Have they added weapons from the later games? I don't think so, no. I think we have all the weapons too. The weapons are very different from the first, from the first game though. Very, very different.
Welcome to Earth. Uh, it's still very... I'm having a great time and it's very fun. I think most of the changes to the game, I'd say, are positive. And there's a couple that kind of like, eh, like head scratching. Like, why did you do that kind of decisions? But most of them are very positive. Hey, Liz, it's Jacob. Um, I couldn't reach you. If you find this, I'm off deck, but I'll be right back. I got a call from another survivor. It sounds terrible. Best launch when there's nothing in a while. Sounds like he's worth the risk. He's a doctor. Uh, Mercer, I think. About time. We caught a fucking break. I love you. Please. Is the game any scarier? Mm, no, it's kind of hard for me because I just know Dead Space so well that I'm also like, I'm not a great person to ask about this because I'm kind of dead inside. I, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm kind of a bad, I'm kind of a bad person to ask. Somebody else probably plays and be like, ah, ooh! for me, I, I, yeah, hard for me. Oh, okay. Doing okay? Okay. Okay. No, I'm good. Uh, coffee. Yeah, when you get back, it's fine. Thanks, babe. Drive safe. Uh, I'm okay. Thanks, babe. Business as usual. Whoa! Bonk. <laughs> I meant to grab the barrel. Oh. Jeez. I meant to grab that. <laughs> That's what I was going for. Oh, well. I'm good, babe. Proceeds to fry a space zombie with a flamethrower. Exactly. Yeah, I've had a ton of fun with this. Been very fun. Save. The Earth equivalent to fried space zombie yeah, meat would be spam. You give me codes for the cargo bay. This is processing. Why the hell would we have codes for cargo? I must get to the marker. We're running out of time. Give me those codes. Christ, is this what you did to the captain? No, no, Ben was an accident. Don't you dare compare me to someone like Mercer. Trying to save me. The Russians are only hope. No, no, no. No. Where the fuck is security? The fuck is that sound? That sounds like a glitch. <laughs> that doesn't sound like that's the sound it should be making.
All right, I think I might put away the line gun here. This marker thing sounds pretty cool, yeah. You're an asshole, game. You're a fucking asshole. You're an asshole piece of shit. I hate you. Uh, I have died twice. I have died two times. Why is am I competing with somebody and I don't realize it? Is that what you guys keep asking? Who am I competing with? Let's go sell the line rack. Who am I complete? Who am I competing with? It's all that me. Uh, Ripper pulse rifle. What do I have in my inventory? Do I have a lot of pulse rifle rounds? Yeah, let's take out the pul I did like the pulse rifle. Let's take that out. Come on, don't bullshit me. And let's put away the line gun. Come on, don't bullshit me. I'm not bullshitting you. I think one air can is enough. Uh, Ripper upgrade. Force gun. I like the force gun. We're just not using it right now. I do like it. Uh, Arctician, thank you for the 64 months. Appreciate that. Uh, Milo Minder Binder, thank you for the 15 months. How does the remake feel so far? I'm having a lot of fun. I'm really having a good time. Well, let's go take out the pulse rifle upgrade. Let's go take that out. Having a good time. What difficulty is it? I say you're saying foreskin. We'll probably find some more of that as we go. Yeah. throw enemies at me here. Oh shit face. How does a flamethrower work in zero G? Uh, I mean, if it could project the fuel out, the fire would continue to go, right? I mean, like anything else? We were already speculating that as long as the flamethrower had what accounted for it, you could have fire in space, right? It might be like, why would you want fire in space? But you could do that. Yeah, yeah. I thought I heard another enemy. Uh, 
Alter Self, thank you for the 26 months. Really appreciate that. Thank you so much, dude. Come on. Don't bullshit me. Kianis, thank you for the 18 months. Thank you very much. We just finished chapter one, and oh my god, these guys are so tanky. It gets a bit better because as time goes on, you uh, you upgrade your weapons. So it does get better. Uh, they, I, they, that was my first reaction is that, man, these guys are tanky. These goofy ass voices. I feel like voices are actually scarier than. I feel like hearing voices saying things and like, like that's actually scarier to me. Not that any one of those things like, but one of the, one of the, let's say it's cooler. Massive library of over a hundred games. Let's say cooler. Are we still in zero gravity? Nope. Fuck. Those, uh, ex these explody guys can be really bad. You gotta watch out for those guys, man. Quaking in your boots over here. People talking to me is scary. Even worse, they directly talk to you. Hey, security clearance level three. Supervisor Dallas, final log. Now I've made sure they can't leave this sub deck, but neither can I. Clearance confirmed. See what they do to the bodies, what they become, and I cannot let that happen to me. At least if I don't have any limbs, <laughs> I can kill anyone when I'm infected. Please tell Dawn. The administrator's rank changed location. You got it? I got it. I'll check the maintenance subdeck for Temple's Beacon. F for Dallas. Yeah, motherfucker cut off his own limbs to prevent him from becoming a necromorph. Hmm? Are we suddenly in Callisto? <laughs> My toe! Um, I haven't seen a workbench anywhere, have I? What do we have here? Um... Let's buy some more plasma cutter. Uh, plasma cutter is kind of my like, I need to get shit done weapon. Can't for I can't afford to fuck around anymore. Let's go buy two power nodes. That's the, I can't fuck around anymore weapon. Okay. What about over here? So do you prefer someone being silent? What's up markup? How's it going? Did it exceed expectations? Yeah, I've been uh, pleasantly surprised by this 
There's a couple of things that I think are kind of like, like, huh? Why did you change that? That's a little weird. Uh, but uh, overall, I'm having a good time. It's been very fun. It's obvious Callisto tried way too hard to be game. Well, correct me, uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, wasn't Callisto Protocol made by one of the devs behind this game? Like one of the devs behind uh, the, the original Dead Space, that is. Was that not one of the original devs or something? Uh, was he the original director or something of the game or? Yeah, yeah, from the OG. Not yeah, that's a good question. Well, I mean, I think uh, I think a video game is very much the sum of its parts. It's it's I'm sure that there are games out there where one person was solely responsible for most of it, but there's also games where it was a team effort, right? So maybe he had the idea for science fiction, but he also had like a really great enemy designer, right? That that he didn't make the enemies. So without that enemy designer, now you've got this like fucking the, all the enemies are basically the same thing. So He was like the lead director. I mean, how many people here, if your manager left your job and got new people that they would not be anywhere near as successful as they are because they're being supported by those people, you know? Inafune's career, remember Mighty Number no. 9? Uh, you know, I don't think I actually want to take this fucking thing with me, actually. It depends. Right, it's a situational thing. Some people some people can do it all on their own. That's very true, but if your manager left, you'd probably be leaving right behind them. A lot of managers can't do shit on their own, that is true. <laughs> Hammond? He must be in the vents on the blue deck. They're bringing something in. I beg your pardon? Game over, yeah! Part two brought to you by EA in 2024 for $200. <laughs> Ban the dev! Ban the dev! It's weird that it didn't send me back to, like, the title. People riot! Uh, I guess, should I, uh, should I, you guys think I should close it out? Son of a bitch. Uh, Da Jamooses, thank you for the 10 months. Thank you very much. Hide him! <laughs> Looks like it crashed. Uh, yeah, that's not looking so good, right? Okay, I think... I recently, all right, we're going to close game. I think I saved pretty recently. I think I did. Get down! Uh, while we're waiting, have some sweetness. Hello, sweetie. Hello, baby, babu, babu. Have some sweetness, chat. While we wait. A little sneaky. Snakey doesn't crash. Uh, continue. Okay. And we're back. We're back in the saddle again. Out where a friend is a friend. 
Yeah, I guess the game crashed. It didn't look like a crash, but it was a crash. The devs are feverishly trying to finish the game and you got too far in. Uh, hey, thanks for the bits. Appreciate it. Standing on. Thanks for the 500 bits. Really appreciate that. Thanks so much. You said the F word. That's bad. Oh, fuck. Fucking asshole. Jeez, man. Fucking assholes. That was rough. Uh, okay. I don't know where the hell we are. Uh, we are playing on hard mode. Uh, also, welcome to the stream, Zazu. How you doing? Good evening. We were playing on impossible mode, and then I died to something really stupid. And then I died again to something also really stupid. Okay, so these are different storage doors. Interesting. How's the remake so far? I've been having a lot of fun with it. I'm also a huge Dead Space fan, so... I love Dead Space. God damn it, fuck this fucking game, this bullshit. Get off me, you motherfuckers! Is this pretty true to the uh the original hey, thanks for the gift sub yug uh yes and no there are a number of changes to the game it is uh they they did not just they didn't just like slap on some new graphics and call it a day they did a lot of things to the game fuck the church don't support the church This is from the beginning of Dead Space 2. How you doing? Good. 
good? You are right, Isaac. The Ishimura is a great ship. I am so lucky to be serving aboard her. We'll enjoy it while it lasts. You know they're gonna decommission her next year. Isaac, thank you. For what? For just pushing me to do this. I mean, if it weren't for you, I never would have made it this far because you made me stick with it. Well, just remember, I'm giving you up for six months so you can do this. You know what? We must be getting a range of the Yes, you, Nikki. Isaac! Oh. What difference does it make now? Terrence, I know the marker is responsible for the outbreak. I need to understand how. The pulse is that signal can trigger alterations in genetic code. Neural structure. You felt it, haven't you? But how do I stop it? Mercer must know. He's taking all his marker research up to his room on the two second zoom. Fuck no. you! <laughs> you know how? What kind of bullshit? <laughs> I need Mercer's data. No, he'll kill you. I won't have more depth on my conscience. Unitology was all I had after I lost Amelia. Look what it's come to. Terrence, listen. I mean, if it weren't for you, I never would have made it this far because you made me stick with it. Well, just remember, I'm giving you up for six months so you can do this. You loved Amelia. As much as I love Isaac, but if I can't cure this outbreak, I'll never see him again. Please, help me. Three, nine, two, seven, seven. He must get into Mercer's room. That coach should still work. Three, nine, two, seven, seven? Here. These are safer with Three, you. nine, two, seven, seven? Dr. Brennan. Nicole. The only thing Mercer ever feared was death. Now? I doubt he's afraid of anything. Find Kynes mining deck hideout. Investigate Mercer's quarters. 39277. Let's keep that in mind. Uh, Samurai 7, thanks to 400 bits. Uh, Chiru for Snakey. Uh, maybe. He was a little pukey yesterday. I don't, know, I don't know if we want to upset his tummy. Kitty pukes. Fuck you. Hmm? Cat, yeah, cats do that. I mean, that's part of why cats like eat grass and stuff, right? Or why cats do that. Cats be puking. Nine seven seven three six four nine seven six six three five. Ah, uh, jerk! Thank you for five dollars. Thanks, jerk. distinct types of voice actors in video games. The ones that want immersion and the ones that do everything in one thing. Come on, don't bullshit me. Oh my god, I can't believe you're here. I thought I'd never see you again. I'm gonna get us home. There's an SOS beacon nearby. We can call for help. The beacon, right. Ah, uh, Werewolf, thanks for five dollars. Tiger Paws, right. thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime. Greatly appreciate that. Welcome. Enjoy your new emotes. Thank you very much. Appreciate it, dude. 
throw the canister. So I guess like are arguably the introduction of the other character we meet on the Ishimura is supposed to make us more and make it more believable now that Nicole is here. I, I guess so that's a part of what you. why? Right? I know. We'll have time, I promise. Let's fix that beacon. Everyone's counting on us. Hmm? How much has changed? It's pretty significantly different. It's very different. Zerg rush. Who's done? The workshop's open. I've never seen you at work. You're a surgeon with that thing. I got your back. Okay. How do I reach you? No, focus on launching that SOS beacon. There's maintenance stacks everywhere. I'll catch up. You'll put things back the way they were and make us whole again. Arbitrary comment with money attached. Is this how chat works? She shouldn't have said that. That makes it too obvious. Ah, uh, werewolf, thank you for the five dollars. Thank you so much. Really appreciate that. She shouldn't have said that makes it too obvious. I mean, it was honestly, it was pretty obvious to begin with in the original, but that makes it even more obvious. <laughs> And here's this totally uncharacteristic thing my character would never say. <laughs> now, that, yeah, I'm well. I was thinking that that's why they had the introduction of this other character, right? Like to make it like, oh, okay, well, maybe she really is alive. What's so obvious? <laughs> The lore, though. I'm gonna meet, eat your heart. Uh, I mean, I love you. Or hundred dollar. So I was kind of, I was kind of following along with the game. Like I knew everywhere we were, and I kind of remembered a lot of parts. The game kind of lost me a little bit. I, I don't know where I am in the main game. They, they they move stuff around enough to confuse me. It's like they combine some stuff or something. I'm heading back to the mining control room. I'll launch the beacon. You watch out for Nicole. Assuming the system doesn't fizzle out again. Are they like made a chapter shorter or something? Maybe I can't. I can't tell. Just feels different. Shit. Okay, what is going on here? That's a good thing. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's pretty different though. I don't. I don't remember this. Is this? This isn't how it is. Oh, so you don't take the gondola back. You turn the gondola off and you turn on zero gravity. I like the effect when you turn on and off gravity. That's so cool, right? Look at that. Isn't that neat? <laughs> That's really cool. I like that. It's also where enga engage the violins.
You fly it's like HR Geiger's Iron Man. Whoa. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get out of here. Uh, guys, guys, help. Somebody help. <laughs> Where the fuck am I? Uh, help. <laughs> it's not getting better. It's getting worse. Uh, is this a ledge? Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, okay, here we go. <laughs> God, that was, that was dizzying. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I was getting a little dizzy there too. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I am literally cat flying right now. <laughs> that fucking Bloodborne boss emote is so funny. Composer still in chat. Oh, we got a we got a lot of beam ammo here. Hope you motherfuckers like beams. What the fuck? Come on, don't bullshit me. Beware, traps ahead. <laughs> that was the scariest thing the whole time. Uh, Nier, thank you for the tier two, 41 months. The Ice, thank you for the 38 months. Thank you very much. You guys are going to start believing that I, people are going to actually start believing that I did ban the dev chat. You got to stop doing that. You yeah, that was the scariest thing thus far. Uh, okay. Uh, man on fire. Thank you for the 26 months. Really appreciate that. Thank you so much. I want to go use that bench. No armor upgrades? What are you talking about? Uh, we just unlocked a new suit, a intermediate minor suit. Uh, I don't have much to sell. I can sell the Ruby semiconductor. That puts me closer. We're still not there yet. Um, all right, almost there. Expen expensivo, yeah. Ain't, ain't cheap. I kind of feel like they what they did here was they combined like three chapters into one. That's why I've been kind of like a little confused here and there. Did I beat the Ocarina of Time Rando? I did not, no. Not yet. 
Uh, all right, so let's see. We got special one. This one is greatly increases the rate of fire, and this one increases magazine. Give this people air. Uh, that's all on the pulse rifle. Uh, what do we got on the flamethrower? Damage capacity. Flame walls burn for longer. Really liking the plasma cutter and the contact beam. Uh, this is reload and speed. I think there's actually, if I'm looking at this right, there's no more additional damage for the contact beam, it looks like. Uh, Chunky Nugget Lord, thank you for the three months. Dude, that, that how'd you know my alt account name? <laughs> uh, thank you very much, appreciate that. My brother! There is a, another damage here we can grab. Let's go grab this capacity here. I'm resubbing to myself. Give nugs, please. Alrighty. money laundering what a courteous slasher waiting for he did wait for me to finish yeah you had some wendy spicy nuggets they're really good with the ghost pepper sauce they're good but then you get the ghost pepper sauce and oh then they're really good little eyes little eyes what secrets have you seen Orator played too many Mario Maker levels. <laughs> too much Mario Maker. Walk it off. Oh yeah, all that spicy shit is nowhere near as spicy as it like as it like says it's going to be. Planet Crack of Ages 7 was conducted today. Everything went smoothly. They seem to be uh problems planet site. We've temporarily lost contact with the colony, but tethers are stable. First rock ball is extracted from the tectonic load approximately one hour after the crack and has been processing refined and smelted for sampling. Results exceeded even optim optimistic initial estimates. Normal recovery is around 35% mineral, 5% fossil, 60% waste. Show for the first ball is 65% uh, mineral. That's 6.5 tons of ore from a 10 ton ball. Full production is now in process, focusing on EQL5. Including, assuming it's not an anomaly, we've hit a mother load. Looking like Neocortex. Administrator access granted. Prepping launch tubes. What was that? The miners must have booby-trapped the launch tubes, too. For scrap. Wow, that's yeah. great. We can't just toss the beacon out a window. Yeah, there's gotta be something. The asteroid. The one in the mining bay for smelting. What about it? If I attach the SOS beacon to that asteroid and then launch it away from the ship, we'd get a clean broadcast. And you'd get yourself killed. The machinery in there is still running, Isaac. Then it probably kept those things out, too. This is our best shot, Kendra. I'm taking it. Man, the flamethrower is fucking strong at this point, dude. The flamethrower is fucking strong. The snaky and necromorph. Uh, Glaceon, what I would say, we haven't really, I think we have all the weapons in the game. 
what i would say is that the weapons have been redesigned at this point like they're they're like the contact beam is nothing like its original version pretty much um and the weapons i would say are oh boy that's very dangerous Man, that did a lot of fucking damage. Holy crap. Uh, like, for instance, I have never, ever, ever... F I, I have always thought the flamethrower is, like, the worst fucking weapon in this game. The flamethrower is, like, really legit in this game. I'd say my favorite guns are the flamethrower and the contact beam. The flamethrower is just fucking useful, man. It's so ammo efficient. It's so ammo, like, you'll essentially never run out of ammo on the flamethrower. I think what the, what the flamethrower lacks is stopping power. Like, it does damage, but it's not staggering the enemies and keeping them away from you. Yeah, I died twice. I died twice. A go me, no. What a snake see somebody outside is opening a car door. He hears it and he's like, Hey yo, sus. Fuck was that? He's probably listening for KD too. Let me go save real fast. <laughs> Dude, Shinto, I have to ask, did EA fuck this up? I am having a really good time. I'm having a really good time. Uh, I would say that this has met and exceeded my expectations. Most of the negative things I'd have to say are minor kind of quibbles and things that I thought the original did a little bit better. But for the most part, I'm having a really fun time. How much con how much beam energy do I have? I have thir I have forty four beam. It's a lot of fucking beam, bro. <laughs> yeah, I'd also say the story feels less engaging. I'd agree with that. Okay, mm have we been in here? not oh. no! kitty left all right guys you know why kitty left because katie got home Katie's home, he's like, all right, I'm gonna head out. Got banned. You ever confuse Kitty and Katie? I feel like Katie and I rarely ever say one another's names to each other. She's never like, Chris, Katie. We, we never do that. <laughs> Hear it. Where the hell is it? Maybe I'm not hearing it.
the fuck? fucking side mission objective it sounds like uh windows 95 i need to start using my stasis more i have a lot of stasis Did EA fuck this up? I would say definitively so far, barring some kind of catastrophe, which I don't think that's going to happen at this point. I would say no, they did not. I think they did a, I think they did a good job with this. Or rather, we'd say that the devs did a good job and EA stayed the fuck out of it, which is how it should be. I'm sorry, is Isaac like stapled together at the midsection? The fuck was that? <laughs> that was fucking garbage. <laughs> that was fucking garbage. Okay. Oh, that's fucking ah. My eyes. Can you turn that light away from me? That's <laughs> okay. Thank you. Knew you should have bet more bread. Yeah, I guess chat. I guess that counts as a death. I'm a little upset. Will Barb die in this chapter? I guess that counts as yes. Isaac just kind of fell apart. <laughs> I would just outright uninstall. I'll oh, fucking calm down. No, my death is one. <laughs> No, it wasn't moving. It wasn't moving. It literally wasn't moving. Oops. No, I've died. That is not my first death. That was my third death. So far, I don't know if this tells you anything. So far, every single one of my deaths has been an instant death to like some kind of environmental 
nothing and has had nothing to do with the necromorphs. It's just been like getting killed by machinery and, and random shit. None of it has been like, oh man, the enemies got me. <laughs> I don't know if that tells you anything. What? Caution. Gravity. Ammo? Oh, you can't. You can't fire the flamethrower in space. You guys were right. You can't. That's pretty funny. Oh, you know what? Maybe it was moving, actually. Maybe it was. Maybe you guys are right. Warning. Payload 8772 is no longer tethered. Untrained personnel must leave the mining bay immediately. You know what? I guess it was it was moving or something. Now the true test would be to do it again. It kills you even when it's not Son moving in the original. Bitch. Uh, mentally inept. I, I just wasn't expecting to die there. That's all. <laughs> it was it was mostly just funny. Uh, mentally inept. Thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Well, you know, to me, I, I don't know if you agree. To, to chat agree or disagree. To me, with games, I think it's it's great how much. I think it's really interesting and uh, fascinating how much your mind does the work for you. Like when I played this game, when I was, you know, like late, like I think I was like in early twenties or whatever, like in my mind, this is kind of what it looks like. Like your mind completes the picture for you in video games. And you don't necessarily need, like, I don't get me wrong. This looks great. It looked, it definitely looks better than the original, but I don't know if I necessarily needed it. Th does that make sense? Like the original game looked fine. It still looks fine to me. Hey, that's crazy. One hundred. Uh, I think I might need you. Right, your your it's like your brain just finishes the work. You know, the, your brain finishes it for you. Whoa, shit. Tony Hawk Pro Skater looked like dog shit, but I played the original and my brain was like, yeah, this is what it was like the whole time. If someone hadn't played either version of Dead Space, which would you recommend? I recommend playing the original before playing this one. I would say play the original and then play this one if you can. That's not to say that I think this game is worse in any way, shape, or form, but I think the original deserves to be played. Whoa, uh... Uh, do you like the Tony Hawk games? Ah, they're okay. I played them when I, I haven't played a Tony Hawk game since I was like fucking 15, dude. It's been a long time, man. <laughs> Give this people air. Django Fett, thank you for the 26 months. Thank you very much. Hmm. Let's go sell the gold semiconductor. Sell another gold semiconductor. Uh, we don't need this many stasis packs. We'll sell one of these. And we can sell another. We'll get our new suit chat. Level four suit, 26 slots, 15% armor. Let's do it. Laminate me. Uh, I'm not really a huge Tony Hawk guy. Uh, thank you mentally enough. Zatrakak, thank you for the tier three 60 months. Five years, a long time to be watching your dumb face. Uh, thanks man, thanks for the money. Uh, Django Fett, thank you for the 26 months. Thank you very much. 
I don't need armor as my only deaths come from one shots. This is very true. I feel like I want the inventory slots more than anything else. Okay, we're poor. Mm, yeah, I think it feels like a kind of in between of Dead Space 1 and 2. Dead Space 2 is kind of categorized by the Kinesis. Now, once in a while in this game, you get to use the Kinesis because there's like a spear or something. And that's pretty cool. But they did I wouldn't say that they fully embraced it. There's even the necromorph blades are around. You can pick those up too. It's like they kind of half-assed put that in there. You know, it's like, uh, kinda, but not really. It's working. The beacon's online, broadcasting wide band. I'll align the receiver. This will take a minute. Head on back to the tram station. I knew it. Detected. It's the fucking regenerators in here. The quarantine ship with that hunter there, the system can't lift the lockdown. Override the middle door release. I'll try. Damn it, the explosion's right half the circuit. Almost there. Hold it off. was that you see that was that just me That's a totally new sequence. That was couple, that was totally new. But I can't be sure. The system's bugged out again. I'm getting those camera glitches. The ones that look like my brother. Waving at me. At least the beacon's away. I'm aligning the... Wait. A ray receiver not responding. Oh, shit. The comms ray. We never fixed it. Guess there wasn't a broken encoder. Then let's hope that 48 hours estimate was wrong, too. No comms, no rescue. <sighs> Take the tram to the bridge. I'll hack open the door to communicate. The regenerator doesn't come back for a while in the original, so he shouldn't. That's not where he is normally, so that's that's a big change. So like they brought him back sooner. She looks mildly annoyed rather than in fear for her life. <laughs> she knows how it ends for her. She knows. She played the first game. That was a fun sequence to watch. So we got an additional graph. So there must be one more suit. 
Kinesis throw damage. Oh, well, I mean, we don't get to do that too often, honestly. Maybe one more suit. What else we got? Plasma cutter. Uh, that's some reload and some more damage over there. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, the reload speed. I use the flamethrower a lot. I don't know. It kind of feels like a waste, though. What else have I been using? The contact, the beam, the pulse rifle. We could do some pulse rifle, too, I suppose. Uh, Glackham, thank you for the 20 months. Yo, how's it going, Glackham? What's up, dude? Uh, thank you very much. Here, let's go. Uh, let's go with the tried and true, the plasma cutter here. It really does get me through a lot. Tried and true. No, I've died uh, three times now. Three times Come all on, to really, to me. really stupid shit. Frothy Coffee, thank you for the Son 22 months. Bitch. Well, appreciate that. Cup of Travis, thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime. Holy crap, thank you so much. I feel like the line gun feels wimpy in this game. I'm a little disappointed. Don't bullshit me. Feels kind of wimpy. Uh, Schnabler, thank you for the five months. Thank you, Schnabler. Chapter 7, Into the Void. Chapter S. All right, chat. That's big sad. Well, I mean, the other weapons got better, so. Will I die in this chapter, chat? What do you think? Right, how many environmental things are in this chapter? <laughs> How much shit is in this chapter? You try not to think. They buffed the other guns. Everybody was just playing with the plasma cutter and the, and the line gun. There's a room behind the boxes. Which which uh, boxes? In here? You see a room? Oh, I think uh, if you're talking about here, I think... Oh, you know what? Yeah, if you're talking about this one, I don't have the master security override. So, I'm all in. No, no. So, my first death, I got hit by the centrifuge. No, it's all good. I got hit by the centrifuge because I timed my run wrong. And I kind of knew it as I was running, but it was too late. I couldn't turn back. The second death, I suffocated because the timer on the oxygen stuff is a lot shorter. The third time, Isaac just kind of fell apart. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, that's, uh, three deaths. All right, looks like we're going back to the bridge. bridge. Two to three have been because of my work. Yeah, I'm, I'm blaming Wyvern. I am holding you solely responsible for all of my deaths. <laughs> Hashtag blame Wyvern. Your fault. I'm authorized use of the this is new. The hell was that? Toad? The Toad? Uh, Schnabler, thank you again for the five months. Appreciate that. Toad was on the tracks. Give this people air. Ah! Uh, GMCB, thank you for the brand new sub. I really appreciate that. <laughs> I thought we were about to get like boarded here or some shit. We're about to get boarded. All right, I gotta get up, chat. I gotta pee. I'll be back in one second, chat. Be right back. Katie like feels bad because she she we were planning on having breakfast for dinner, but like she got home late and I'm streaming late, so it was just kind of one of those things where it didn't work out. But she's like, "Oh no, are you sure? Are you sure?" I'm like, "No, I'm fine. I'm fine, baby. I'm fine. I just had chicken nuggets. Like I'm fine." War! I had chicken nuggets. I'm good to go. 
did it. Hep, Isaac, a ship just shot in. The USM Valor. They must have heard our SOS. That fast? What's a military ship doing way out here? Breakfast or dinner is S tier. It is really good. Rescue from a fucking magpie. Head for communications. Once we fix the comms array. Spicy nuggies? Hell yeah. What does Katie do to keep busy with that she isn't working at the school? Well, you know, when I'm not fucking your mom, Katie likes to fill in for me and she also fucks your mom. <laughs> you still need power nodes for this? No, no more power node doors. None of those. <laughs> it's a carousel over here. <laughs> Oh man. Fuck you, man. <laughs> uh they took out power node doors. I didn't I don't mind I think power node doors were interesting because it was like a trade-off of like uh you asked Pooh to sub to and he said you, he's your boy. Uh Pooh is my good friend, yeah. Or as, as you would say, he is my boy. Um, but uh, hey, thanks, Pooh. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I didn't mind the trade-off of power node doors of uh, like, you wanna use your power node for an upgrade or do you want resources? Like, I think that that's an interesting idea. I think in the base game, it never really works out that way because it's always worth it to use a power node. So you just always wanted to keep one. So I, I understand, you know, yeah, you'd often, you, if you didn't get a node back, you would get so much money back that you could just buy a node. So it, it ended up like it was always worth it to do it. Um. <laughs> oh, thank you, GMCB. I really appreciate it. Shit. Oh, that's really bad. I went over here to go get these and I trapped myself because they had the exploding guys right here. So I was I was a little that was a bad situation Another that one. can go south very I'm quickly. Spikes on local comms. If whatever's wrong with the comms array is spreading. No, that's not it. So uh, uh the door to communications should be open. You can head down to the comms control station. And Isaac, watch what you say. I think someone's listening in. Yeah, they, they straight up removed Hammond as a character. And I don't really like the voice actor who they got for Hammond, but I kind I really miss Hammond as a character. I feel like he kind of gave the game like a narrative kind of focus to it. Cause he was like actually the major character you hear talking most of the game. Like he kind of tells you what's going on and what to expect and stuff. And they like, they just straight up removed him. Like he's just like not even in the game anymore. It's kind of a shame. Yeah, dude, and uh, the original voice actor did such a great job. The original voice actor did such a great job. I wouldn't say the game is less handholdy. If anything, I would say it's more because there's more like Kendra and the other female character. Hey, whatever happened to the other female character anyway? The, the other scientist? Whatever happened to her? Did she die or something? I have no idea. What the hell happened to her? <laughs> uh, jo was that her name? Johnson? I, I don't even remember. She'll be fine. 
She got blown up with the ship. Did she? The, yeah, the botanist. What the hell happened to her? I suspect Hammond getting less lines and not getting the original voice actor is connected. Oh, was it death? Oh, was that death sounds? Was that <laughs> Are you 11 hours in the game? No, I played Hades this morning for about three or so hours. Um, the game didn't unlock for a little while. I'll tell you what, the original fucking flamethrower in the original game could not fucking do that. <laughs> Man, that necromorph sure had a familiar sounding scream. Sure sounded familiar. Yeah, the original flamethrower was like fucking unusable. Without Hammond, how is the Valor going to get screwed over? I think they're going to... I I would. I don't know for sure yet. I feel like they're going to kill Hammond in the exact same way they did in the original. The whole point of the original, though, is that you see... You know something's going on because Kendra's being suspicious of Hammond and Hammond's like, no, it's not... I'm not... There's, stop. Back off. It's not me, right? And then you find out... Then you find out... Hammond is actually like a real like he's actually really helping you out. He's a good dude. He is who he says he is and then he dies like he kind of dies in like a horrible way. It's like, oh, no, Hammond. This game's not really going to have that because it's like, oh, whatever. That guy. That guy who's been gone forever. Whoa. I just realized I have no stasis. Yeah, this room, we're back in this room now that everything is turned off. We haven't been in this room for a little while. You missed Snake? Yeah, sorry. He's been here all day. Yeah, I've died three times. The snake afraid of the scaries. Okay, how? There you go. <laughs> uh, snake, I have headphones in. Snake can't hear any of this. He doesn't hear a fucking thing. I think the stream is 7 out of 10 so far. It could improve with more cat. Okay, game says that way. What's over here? We haven't been in here before. I'd like to hear an audio log of what Katie Thiers, uh, hears in the run of the day. <laughs> But what does Katie's average day sound like? I think for the most part, you don't hear a fucking word out of me the entire day. And then you're going to hear fucking bullshit. This is bullshit. And then completely back to normal for a while. So chat, what would you, what would you give to have Snakey back on stream? What would you do if you could get Snakey back on stream? What would you, if you think, if you think Snakey's so great, what would you do to get Snakey back on stream? Huh? What would you do? My net worth. A smile. A million subs. Well, you know what, chat? You know what? Wish granted. 
There you go. Ogabonani. Hello, go bunny. What a cutie. Fens, thank you for five gift subs. Thank you so much. Sedale, thank you for the gift sub. Uh, Waffle, hello, thank you for the 1,000 bits. Thank you, Waffle. They say hello. Hello, Snakey. Hello. Uh, he says hi, too. Look at his little paws. If you can, I recommend... Whoops. If you can, I recommend playing the original game first. If you can't, it's okay to just play this game. That's okay. I'm a sleepy boy. I'm so sleepy. Wrong way. Uh, thank you, Wall Flyerny. Appreciate it. Come on. Don't bullshit me. Communications array offline. A repair technician has been notified. Communications log. First comms operator Bailey reporting. I want this on record. The ship is under attack, but Captain Matthias has refused to issue a distress call. And we all know why. This whole operation is illegal. Aegis 7 was sealed off. They knew it, we knew it, and we all kept our mouths shut. That is now. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. This is USG Ishimura calling. Wait, what the hell? He took the whole comms array offline. It's over. Are you happy about the remake uh, with how the remake turned out? All things be all things considered, I think you couldn't we couldn't really ask for better. Fry. Someone hot wired the dishes together and blew up the system. So we screwed. No, it was sloppy work. Some of the dishes are intact. If I replace them and create a new circuit with no gaps, we could broadcast a signal. Short range only, but it should work. I feel like Isaac would say, like, hey, I saw Nicole and she's here, she's alive. I feel like he would say that to these characters since he you know it's believable in the original game it's believable he wouldn't say anything because he never says anything in this game it's like wouldn't you say like hey i saw nicole she's alive like nope nothing <laughs> never says it Cheers could do an Alien Isolation style game, no combat survivor in 87. There's a Wii, there's a Dead Space game for the Wii that's supposed to be really good. Hey, thanks for the game. I never played it. You? It's a Dead Space, is it Dead Space Extraction? Is that what it's called? Uh, Lori No Lie, thank you for the gift sub. Appreciate that, thank you very much. Did he? Did he say it? I don't know, maybe I didn't hear it. I might've been yapping or thanking a sub or something. Maybe that's it. Baby, the other, other white meat. The combat in Zero G is awesome. I'd say it's okay. Wouldn't say it's awesome. It's okay. Okay, so I remember this part pretty distinctly from the original. This looks pretty different. I'd say it's okay. Are we drinking tonight? I'm drinking coffee. Uh, it's weird. It's like I can't walk on this stuff. All right, let's take a look. 
We got some fucking busted ass ones. M. Saney, thank you for the tier three resub. I really appreciate that. Thanks so much. Is this like Come a on, different? Don't bullshit me. It's almost like this is like a different puzzle. Do I have to get the power in there by doing this? Son of a bitch. If this is like a different puzzle here. Interesting. Praise the fear. Thank you for the 38 months. Really appreciate that. Duct tape wizard. Thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Appreciate it, guys. Ooh, interesting. So you have to like connect it in a certain way here. Ah. Okay. Okay, so it can't go in through there. All right, how are we looking on this? So yeah, it looks, uh, it's interesting. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I see the lines. In the original, it's it's not like this at all. Yeet. Okay. Do I, do I have enough? I'm sure I have enough here. Uh, I'm not sure I do. Uh, I might have actually gone the wrong way here. Uh, I'm not sure. It's kind of interesting. I actually kind of like this change. I actually kind of like it. Nobody tell him. I kind of like this change, actually. It's cool. Puzzle master at work. I, I'm pretty good at puzzles considering how many fucking puzzle games you guys have made my ass play. Pretty decent at him. Uh, are there more? Okay, so it's pretty clear we can't reach it from here because there's no more satellites. So we need like a more, we need like a more efficient way of doing it, basically. We need a more efficient way to do this. We can't reach it from this way. Okay. Have I played Super Liminal? I have not, no. Uh, hello? There we go. Uh, can I just reach it from, from like right here? Did I only need like two the entire time? You suck, you duckass. Yeah, yeah. No, that's wrong still. Hmm, interesting. Oh, they really, uh... They really changed this, didn't they? I can go here. Why are you and Moon both playing Dead Space? Uh, I mean, this game just came out, so I, you're probably going to see a lot of Twitch streamers playing it. Not just, you know, the big ones. There's probably a ton of smaller streamers, too. Two hours later. Okay, now I just need one there. Copycat. Why are two streamers playing the same game? <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe it. Uh... How does that not work? What? 
How does that not work? <laughs> what? Bullshit. The lion's right there. How does that not work? How does that not work? Uh, I don't get it. The lion's decent at best. Bruh, you're a brute forcer. So I guess the red lines mean you cannot go that way. So you need the other kinds of lines, I guess. Guess that's what that means. Are these, are there, how many different colors are there in the lines? Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is it the shape? Oh my God. Is it the shape on the actual satellites themselves? Is that what determines it? Oh my God. Okay. Wow. This is so radically different from the original. <laughs> I had, I honestly, I just now noticed that. I just now noticed. Um, okay. So, give this people. I, I didn't see that there was even a thing. I didn't even see that. Okay, so if this goes here, um, if we wanted to do it like this, this would have to be here, right? Come on. Right, right. The original panels, every single one is just the same. You just have to put the fixed. You just have to put the ones that aren't broken in a circle. And then like, that's it. Like Come there, Don't there is me. no puzzle. Like that's just it. So this is uh, pretty different. Okay. Now what is the shade? Um... I thought you said you got it. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm getting it. I, I'm not, I don't got it. I'm getting it. <laughs> there's, there's a difference. Okay. I like this change. Um, now if I do this, are we good? Uh, let's see. Oh, there's a, there's a straight line one over here. I don't know if that matters. Okay, so this one, I can't do it here because this one doesn't connect. But if I do this and then put the straight line one here, that should be it. There we go. I actually really like that. That was cool. I like that a lot. Neat. to the valor finally it was so much like simpler in the original that was a that was a cool change Come on, don't bullshit me makes you happy that this game hasn't been a letdown you know snakey you are not being enter very entertaining sir you need to be you need to you need to ship it up Stay up. Huh? <laughs> Need to be more entertaining. Why? No! 
Snake might be the first cat that kind of, well, uh, I guess other bloggers and shit make money off their cat, right? He might be the first cat that kind he kind of pays his way in the house. He's, he does more than George does. George doesn't do a fucking thing. Snake kind of pays his own rent. Milking my cat. Okay. Let's go save here. That tracks when it comes to Costanzas. Dead Mouse's cat has an OnlyFans. Snakey, you want to have an OnlyFans? Would you guys subscribe to Snakey's OnlyFans? <laughs> Managed by Katie. Yes. <laughs> this is USM Valor. Widecasting on all frequencies to USG Ishimura. Only pause. To your SOS. We picked up your escape pod number 47 and are en route to your position. This message will repeat every 30 seconds until you respond. Give this people air. Escape pod. Oh, fuck. The pod hammer jettisoned. It had chip. That creature was inside. No, 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 no. USM Valor, come in. Come in, Valor. Oh, her signal isn't strong enough. Can we deploy the long range antenna? No, something's blocking the blast doors over the comms array. The hell? There'll be a manual release over at maintenance. I'll go. Keep trying to reach them. Yeah, that was the escape pod that Hammond jettisoned and that had the monster inside. That's what the ship is going to pick up. Uh, how's the remake been so far? It's been fun. I'm having a good time. We'll get this on YouTube uh, pretty fast, too. <sighs> 20 hour long game. Uh, I mean, I've beaten the... I think the last couple times I've played Dead Space 1, I've played the games many times. I think it took me like 10, 11 hours. So I think the length is comparable to the original. Wouldn't say it's significantly longer or shorter. It did kind of feel like they kind of blob some chapters together at one point, but it feels like, uh, like fairly similar length, I suppose. Is it mostly a grab? There's a lot of gameplay stuff. There's a lot of changes. Personal log, it happened again. Third time in the last however long it's been. I came in after they found Russo at the transmitter again. They looked like hell. I don't know if they, ever, if they even slept the last time I caught them in here. Not very reassuring to see the chief engineer in that state. Russo didn't hear me come in, so this time I just listened. They were talking to the relay crew again. Talking and listening, they even laughed. God, how long has it been since anyone on this fucking ship laughed? But I just say something engineering. I've already told Russo over and over that we don't have a comms relay crew. That the array is beyond broken, uh, broken beyond repair. That no one is coming to save us. And they listen, but it's like they can't keep their thoughts in their head. As if it's too much. I get it. Everything on the ship is too much. So this time, I just let them talk. If, it's, if a broken transmitter and a mic full of static gives them something to hold on to, maybe it helps them uh, keep the ship running a little longer. Who am I to judge? And yeah, maybe I've talked into the same rant transmitter myself once or twice after hours, just in case. Like that poem says, hope sings the tune without the words and never stops at all. Have you died again? Uh, I've died three times. Three times? How was the asteroids part? Dude, they fucking like, it's like a joke in this one, honestly. They they made it a total joke. Uh, sure. Put something towards the flamethrower there. Lots of environmental deaths, yeah. <laughs> Lots of those. Oh shit.
Those enemies, man. Those enemies are no joke. Uh, been in Elden Ring all day, so I had to miss your stream. What are my thoughts on this game? Uh, I'll tell you later when I finish. I'm having fun. Hey, it's locked in. Weapon upgrade. A plasma cutter upgrade. Okay, okay. Oh, have you been have you been in the ER? Have you been in Elden Ring? <laughs> I read that. I don't know why I read ER as Elden Ring. <laughs> oh man, you playing Elden Ring all day, huh? Uh, I <laughs> That's pretty funny. Uh, I have been having a lot of fun so far. Uh, there's it's it's been I've had a good time with it. It has exceeded my expectations. Come on, don't bullshit. Hope me. you had fun playing Elden Ring today. <laughs> <laughs> oh man uh frenzy thank you for the 35 months thank you very much how is that's not krungo how's that krungo it's funny <laughs> Ooh, I have, do i have force energy plane throw fuel not really no uh let's buy a nude Right. <laughs> I was in the Elden Ring repairing my my broken limbs. Dreamer brain out. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> it break. God. God forbid you fuck up once. I didn't even say anything like mean. <laughs> I just read it wrong. Dreamer strain. Is this a secret 24 hour? The really emergency room. <laughs> I don't know. I saw ER and I thought Elden Ring before that. I don't know why. You read it the same way? Uh, I, may, I, I guess I've just got ma major streamer brain. Okay, man, it really feels like they're kind of gearing me up for a boss fight here, doesn't it? Um, I don't know what this is going to be. I need to touch grass. Yeah, maybe I should. I didn't even see the, I didn't even see the sun today. <laughs> what? I can't create more. No more saves for me. Um, okay. Sure. Save me there. It's been, I'd say I'm surprised at how different it is. I'm, I'm surprised at how different. It's quite different. Okay, this must be where like the next chapter is. Yeah, wow, it's 8.30 already, goddamn. Error. Glass doors obstructed. Please contact a repair technician. So Radagon of Radagon in place of the wolf. It's blocked by... It's the Leviathan. It must have snagged on the comms array after we spaced it. It's not coming off without a fight. Isaac, there's no time. There is if I use the ADS cannons. Manual targeting like before. I can shoot it right off the hull. I got this. You focus on the Valor. Will do. Deploy the antenna. All right. Entering vacuum. Entering zero gravity. Manual targeting enabled. Whoa, 
what the fuck? Is there oxygen refill here? Yes, there is. I hit like some kind of edge there. I guess I guess space has a limit there. I found the edge of space. Warning. Whoa. ADS cannon destroyed. Hey, when I find the limits of space. Oh, there's there's more O2 by the door as well. Pesky, pesky space limits. Manual targeting enabled. Warning. ADS cannon destroyed. Uh, where was the door I want to refill on O2? What the fuck? I kind of can't tell how much. I don't know if I have like no health or full health. This is a lot of shit. Ah. Uh, Come on, don't bullshit me. Really hard to tell what's happening in these sections. Dude, do we fucking clutch that? Oh, the clutch. The clutch. Man, I almost fucking died. I think I, I think I'm, it's hard to tell in space uh, with the colors being so washed out. Um, but I'm pretty sure I'm just about dead. Yeah, I'm like almost dead. <laughs> Man. Oof. Yeah, I have I, I have no health either. Mweep. Mweep. That was rough. 
One HP with one second left. Yeah, we didn't have a lot of time on that one. Okay. Come on, jump scare for death. I think if you farted on Isaac, he would die right now. What happened to impossible mode? When you die in impossible mode, it gives you the option to keep playing on hard mode. I took that option. I wish that they would stop putting the L1, R1 to take off. They put it on there constantly. Like, I get it. I understand. Daniels, what happened? Something shook the whole crew deck. What hit it? An asteroid? First thing got onto the Valor. A rescue ship. They found your escape pod. And the one that used to be Chen. It's... God damn it! The Valor's scrap. By the time another ship hears the SOS beacon, we'll all be dead. No, that's what I was telling you. I found an yeah. executive shuttle on the crew deck. Intact. No, impossible and hard mode are the same thing, Mr. Doobie. They, it literally says that in the opening Wait, thing. Maybe it can. If the Valor seal their course, okay. I can salvage it. Install it on that shuttle. We're fucking out of here. Where's the Valor now? It's near Combs. How far are you into it? We're getting uh, close. We're like, I want to say we're like 70 to 75 percent in. Let's see you see clean up their own mess. I'm saving what I can. Oh, are we not going out here? Oh, I thought we we're going out to the ship. Oh, we are. Oh. <laughs> hmm? Am I going to try New Game Plus? They say New Game Plus is like a different thing. It's got like a different ending, right? Um, Isaac, I'm on board. The Valor's trapped. I'm intrigued. To the bridge. Maybe not immediately, but... What the hell was that? Exiting zero gravity. All right. Well, I didn't die in that. Hang on. I'm 100 percent playing this again soon. Uh, chat. Will Barb die in this chapter? It was close, but no, I did not die. No, I did not.